If you're looking for a great cloud operating system to work with in 2025, then you may just be in the right place. Today, we're going to have a look at Zimmer OS. We're also going to have a look at Casa OS. We're going to have a look at TrueNAS and Hex OS. We are going to put them head to head. We want to know why you should be using it and how they can actually benefit you. So let's climb in. Okay, let's have a look at Zimmer OS. So it is cloud optimized. It's built specifically for modern cloud computing environments. It's architectured to protect critical workloads from the ground up. And it also supports massive applications across virtual machines as well as containers. It's engineered for low latency operations and high transaction volumes. It tracks system health and resources all in real time, and you can deploy patches and updates with minimal system interruptions. It also has advanced sandboxing technology, which keeps applications securely separated. You can connect seamlessly to any major public clouds as well as private clusters and you get protected data at rest and in transit with compliance ready features. All right, so we're jumping into Casa OS now. So Casa OS is a very modern, very lightweight home cloud operating system designed with simplicity at its core. It is a home cloud operating system focused on the simplicity and the user experience. Yeah, that means you. It has easy installations via script or one click on select devices. It also allows you um, to install popular apps from the App Store, including Plex, Nextcloud, Jellyfin. And it has a centralized dashboard with real time system data. You can also see over here that it is a minimalist modern web UI with an intuitive navigation system and automatic network device discovery. You also get quick remote access to files via browser or even your mobile device with a visual app management. You can set up private uh, family clouds with media streaming and automatic photo backup on lightweight hardware like Raspberry Pi. You can also see over here that it is um, and it has native support for popular smart home devices with unified control panels for lights, thermostats and even sensors. You can create custom triggers and actions between connected devices and CASA OS applications. It integrates also with popular voice assistants for hands-free control of your home cloud environment. And the intuitive API allows developers to extend smart home capabilities with custom integrations and community contributed modules for uh, maximum capabilities. Also, it's detailed performance tracking and Capacity management allows you to monitor all of your performance and it has a built in replication and a cloud sync. So if you need more than one backup option, it's got what you need. Let's have a look at some of their real world applications. First of all, design agency store and collaborate on large project files. And this is done securely. Security systems utilize ZFS for reliable footage, storage, as well as retrievals, and tech enthusiasts can build custom scalable solutions for their personal use. Let's have a look at Hex OS now, and it is a next generation platform for high volume business intelligence. It offers instant ingestion and transformation of structured as well as big data, and you can scale across on-premises and cloud infrastructures seamlessly. It distributes architecture, handles massive data sets effortlessly, and you can connect SQL, no SQL databases and REST API feeds. And it's built in machine learning recognizes patterns and forecast trends. The last thing we're having a look at here is some of the experience and collaboration. So you can actually customize your dashboard with widgets and alerts tailored to your specific needs. There's no coding required for most of the visualizations as well as the reports. You can control access with more role based permissions and detailed audit logs. This ensures compliance with automated policy enforcement 
and you can share reports instantly with team workspaces and annotation tools. This enables cross-department insights with a unified view. And there we go, ladies and gentlemen, a software comparison. Now you can actually see what benefits and features are offered and you can make a decision as to which one is best for you according to your own needs. My personal advice is to go out and use them or see what works for you in a real life scenario and then make a decision thereafter. If this was helpful, drop us a like and we'll see you next time.